Journey's about to troll the world with this title. Woo wee! Yo, what's up everyone? Trainman one here. Welcome back to another Pokemon Journeys anime discussion video. Guys, we have four new episode titles and a new special preview to cover in today's episode with a lot of information to talk about. So let's not waste no time and get right into it. So the original episode from 105, which we already knew already, a new show, Team Rocket's Undercover Kingdom Radio, has been switched to episode 106. I don't know the reason why, but the new episode 105, ooh, this is a troll title. Evie and Sylveon, Encounter and Reunion. Obviously, you know, Evie and Sylveon and Reunion being in the same title, many people are going to believe that this is going to be the episode that Serena appears. This is the episode right after the X and Y 2 part with Clement and Bonnie at that. But no, folks, I don't really think this is going to be the case. They would have at least teased Serena a lot more, especially for this to be the same episode that Licia and Wallace are going to be in. Yes, Serena is doing contests, but knowing these Evie episodes from their past experience, I don't really see this being the episode where they put Serena, Wallace, and Licia, and Chloe doing contests all in the same episode. So this Sylveon may actually be Licia's, and the reunion is actually with Wallace, which it kind of sucks because, you know... Yeah, Wallace is a cool character. Ash, you know, they have some moments with Wallace and Diamond Apparel and the Hoenn series, but... Hey! Reunion? Yeah, okay. We know Lycia's main Pokemon is Mega Altaria, and we, we didn't see the Keystone in the actual preview, so we all thought that Mega Altaria was going to be here with her. But seeing how Mega Altaria is going to be in the episode right before with Drasna, I don't really see them doing a two Mega Altaria episodes back to back. So I guess they're switching up Mega Altaria from Licia and giving her Sylveon, which makes kind of sense. So yeah, that episode, I'm looking forward to see how it goes down. I wonder if we will get any references to May or Serena. That's because, you know, she's wearing the May outfit and this is a little Eevee pin with Serena's Eevee. So we'll, we'll have to wait and see. Now the next two episode titles are the Mars interesting ones. The first one is Help Yamper Big Brother. Yamper's finally coming back to me! But right after Yamper's return is Lucario and Greninja. The Wave of Destiny. That's right, folks. Koga. Not only Koga, but Koga and Kario working together. It's a dream come true. Koga, I love you. I miss you, Koga. Now, this Yamper episode is actually pretty interesting to me because ever since Chloe's got Eevee, Yamper has been shafted. Like, man. So I'm glad to see that they're finally giving Yamper some attention again. I do wonder if, you know, what this could be about. Because Big Brother, like, we know Chloe doesn't have a big brother. We, he has, she has a little brother. So maybe this episode could be Yamper is meeting a bolt hunt. My prediction is that Sonya is actually going to be in this episode with a bolt hunt. Because, you know, Yamper is normally Sonya's, like, kind of assistant Pokemon in the games. We do have a TCG card, though, however, with Sonya and a Bolt Hunt. So I would love to see Sonya come back with a Bolt Hunt and, I don't know, maybe have some type of interaction with Yamper. We don't know what this episode could hold. All I know is one thing. If Yamper can come back, bring back Mr. Mime. Now on to the main thing we've been waiting for. <laughs> it's finally happening. guy, he's coming back. <laughs> Next move. With Cardio! Let's go! This episode is so hype. Greninja and Lucario, a Bond focused episode. So, this is what I would want it to see for the longest when Ash brings back his old Pokemon to meet his new ones. Like, you know, they kind of train together. When I first heard he was going back to Alola after he lost to B, I'm thinking the Alola team may train the Journeys team to, for that rematch, but that didn't end up happening. Then we came back to, you know, Oak's Lab. That one really wasn't focused on the Journeys team or the old Pokemon. It was just mostly focused on Infernape, so I kind of let that one pass. But seeing that Greninja's coming back to train Lucario, this is big because, you know, Ash and Lucario have Mega Evolution. Ash and Greninja have Battle Bond and the Ash Greninja form. So I wonder if Ash Greninja and their bond is going to somehow transfer over to Ash and Lucario, not causing Greninja to lose his form or anything like that. If Journeys do something stupid like that, ooh, that's going to be a bad move from them. But I'm hoping that, you know, maybe Ash Greninja can train Mega Lucario to, you know, just get stronger, get a better bond with Ash. You know, we've been seeing Ash and Lucario with their aura bond and aura powers, and we know Ash and Greninja has something like that too, so they could tie something in. Both of these Pokemon have to go against an OP Charizard. Greninja losing to Mega Charizard X, and now here, Lucario has to fight against Leon's Charizard. So I feel like this could go hand in hand some way where Greninja passes on his skills that he learned to Lucario some way, shape, or form. 
I also do wonder if the Zygars are going to be involved in this episode as well because, you know, Greninja was working with Zygar. I've even seen some theories about Greninja's giant shuriken somehow helping Lucario with a giant aura sphere that we see in the opening. That would be pretty cool to see. Whatever they decide to do, I can't wait. Call guys finally coming back to me to help Kario. Let's go. But with that being said, I can't wait to see what Journeys brings us in the next month. It seems like a lot of X and Y love, which I'm loving because that's a series that I started doing my YouTube channel on. So I can't wait to see what they decide to do and how everything plays out. In the comment section down below, let me know what your thoughts on this video. What are you most excited for? And, you know, let's go. Call guys back. And Kario. Trade Man 1, peace out. Peace out.